Let's learn how to import data. In order to import data, we simply use Excel and create a spreadsheet of all of our data. As you can see, the data appears in Excel, has the column headings as described in each course, and each column has data. For person number one, you can tell they had two defaults. Now that we have the data, we need to save it. We need to save it as a certain format. We can go Save As and choose the Open Document Spreadsheet Format, or ODS. This allows for the easiest importation of data into PSPP. Also, it is the format of the file you just downloaded, so you can skip this step. But in the future, make sure you save your data using ODS. Now that you have your data saved and it appears on the desktop, as you see up here, it is time to import it into PSPP. As you can see, PSPP is open, and we go to File and Import Data. Our file resides on the desktop, so we choose Desktop. And of course, here's our data set. We click the data set and click Next. We also know that our data set has the very first row containing all the variable names. So all we do is click that and check it on. Afterwards, we click Next. And since the screen is blank, there's nothing left to do, and we click Apply. As you can see, all your data has appeared in nice columns with all the correct headings. However, there's a blank. Sometimes this happens. So when you look at your data, just scan through it really quick and fill in any blanks that might be missing. In this case, we're missing the 2 from cell I2. So we just pop in, click, press number 2, and press tab, and there we go. The rest of our data is imported nice and clean and all ready to go. And that's all there's to it. Happy PSPPing!